Hey guys, I am Vignesh and welcome back to my YouTube channel Cloud and AI Analytics. Hope everyone are doing good. So in today's video, we are going to see uh, how to pass customer managed encryption key while creating Google Cloud Storage Bucket. So um, this is the objective for today's video. We will be basically seeing what are the different types of encryption keys available in Google Cloud, how to use customer managed encryption key, basically how to create that and how to use while creating bucket. So this is the objective for today's video. I hope it is clear and then without any further delay, let's get started. So basically, there are three types of encryption keys available in Google Cloud. One is Google managed encryption key. So when we are by default, everything in Google Cloud is encrypted and decrypted using this uh, Google managed encryption key. It is fully managed by Google Cloud and we don't need to worry about anything. No configuration and thing. The second thing is customer managed encryption keys. So when we talk about customer managed encryption keys, we will be using, uh, we will be creating a separate uh, encryption key uh, by ourselves by using uh, by using Google Cloud Platform called KMS Key Management Service under security. So we will be using this uh, this service to create a customer managed encryption key, and with the help of this key, we will be encrypting and decrypting the process. So uh, everything is done in uh, Google Cloud only. We have to do this explicitly by passing this cloud. Um, by passing this encryption keys while creating uh, any site of any while while creating any um, any bucket or some other services so the key rotation everything it is taken care by uh, us so it is we will be creating a key ring in cloud kms services and then this man this will be managed by customer basically by the users and we will rotate the key everything will be done by us not not by google but we will be using for this we will be using google cloud service and the next thing is customer supplied encryption keys so customer supplied encryption keys we will be using only in as part of cli command that is using gsutil we will talk more about customer supplied encryption key in the next video for now we will talk we will discuss about customer managed encryption key so to do that i am going into my console google cloud console so this is my google cloud console and this is key management if you are not already enabled the api make sure you have enabled the api as well then you will land into this uh, this page so key management here we will create keyring click on this create keyring and we will use come keyring name like demo customer managed encryption key and let it be regional resource and region let it be your central one so then click on create here we can see what is the project name the one we, which i'm currently using project id the keyring name is demo and the location is us central one what type of key do you want to create like generated key we are not going to import or we are not going to externally managing we are going to generate the key using in this uh, key management service the key name will be demo 01 and the protection level it is for software and the purpose is to encrypt and decrypt like we will talk more about this asymmetric sign asymmetric decrypt all those things in the next or uh, in upcoming videos for no purpose let it be symmetric encrypt and decrypt so the 90 rotation period is like, like we can uh, configure it 30 days 80 days or even we can create custom also for now i'll give it 30 days and if you want to add label you can add for example test I'm adding dummy labels here and then I'll click on this create button. So make sure uh, our key is created in one particular region US central one. US central one. So whatever the bucket which we are about to create it also should be by should be present in uh, that same location. First now we will search for cloud storage. Click on this cloud storage. There is already two existing buckets demo 0102 if you scroll down to the right you can see under encryption it is by google managed key now click on this create button and click on this name your bucket demo 06 hyphen 006 and then click uh, let it be region under region you choose us central one and for now like we have already know what is this rest everything will be same and uh, um, prevent like choose how to control access well for now let it be continue and the data encryption here we have to pass customer managed encryption key 
under this customer manager encryption key when you click on this you can find whatever we create in demo 01 whatever we created here right the same we can find under this room the moment you choose some other location for example if i'm choosing some other location for us east one then we will be not able to get this customer managed encryption because the key which we created it belongs to us central one so we have to use the same region us central one and then you have just click on this demo bucket and you have to grant the um, and I required access to this service account basically you have to grant this crypto key encrypt decryptor role to this service account uh, you just click on this successfully granted and then click on this bucket it will take some 10 15 seconds to create a bucket yeah bucket is created if you come out of this bucket you can see you have passed you have created a bucket demo 06006 using customer managed encryption key and rest everything will be applicable whatever you are able to do it in this bucket this bucket we can do same in uh, this bucket as well so that's it for today's video i hope you learned how to create a, a key customer managed encryption key on your own uh, using cloud key key management service if you have any questions or any doubts please post in the comment section i'll take a look at it and reply as soon as possible please do like comment share and subscribe to cloud and ai analytics and don't forget to click on the bell icon I'll see you in the next video with interesting topic from Google Cloud Services. Until then, it's bye from Vignesh. Happy learning. Thank you.